new report released by Bot Sentinel has revealed that some people are making thousands of dollars online by targeting Prince Harry and his wife Meghan Markle. The couple is settled in California along with their children after stepping down as senior members of the British royal family. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are being targeted in a coordinated campaign. By Webdesk January 19, 2022 Thousands of dollars being made online by targeting Meghan and Harry, report. A new report released by Bot Sentinel has revealed that some people are making thousands of dollars online by targeting Prince Harry and his wife Meghan Markle. The couple is settled in California along with their children after stepping down as senior members of the British royal family. Bot Sentinel, a free nonpartisan platform developed to classify and track inauthentic accounts and toxic trolls, released its third and final report on on single purpose hate accounts targeting Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. The report demonstrates how single purpose hate accounts coordinate on several platforms, use Twitter to spread disinformation, monetize their hatred, and circulate conspiracy theories on YouTube. Christopher Boozy, Bot Sentinel founder and CEO, said, We published our report on the coordinated hate campaign targeting Harry and Meghan, Duke and Duchess of Sussex. We illustrate the conspiracy, and we believe it is the most comprehensive and damning report on this topic. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are expected to amass a billion dollar fortune from Diana's inheritance, eight figure deals with TV giants and their Sussex royal brand following their departure from official royal duties, but taxpayers could still be picking up the couple's £3 million bodyguard bill because of fears they won't be kept safe in Canada. The abdication agreement with Her Majesty has cost the Sussexes their HRH titles, but it will allow them complete and absolute freedom to secure tie-ups with Silicon Valley giants such as Apple and Netflix or US TV networks while avoiding dodgy commercial deals that would upset the Queen. Experts have claimed that US TV networks could be willing to pay the couple £38 million, $50 million, book deals, £20 million for US TV interviews and £470,000, $600,000, based on the amounts secured by the Obamas since they left the White House. And Prince Charles is expected to pay his £2.3 million annual payment to his son for at least another year while they set up in Canada, despite the couple having an estimated joint net worth of £34 million, $44 million. Harry has his own wealth, including an estimated £20 million inheritance from Princess Diana and £7 million from the Queen Mother. Meghan is thought to be worth £4 million, accumulated mainly from her seven years on suits. The couple are predicted to have such incredible earning power they could build a $1 billion brand having spent part of 2019 secretly trademarking the Sussex brand on items such as pyjamas, hats and hoodies but this is expected to be impossible without angering Harry's grandmother and father. But despite the Megxit deal being hammered out at the Sandringham summit hosted by the Queen this month, there are still a number of unanswered questions about who will fund the couple once they settle abroad, and how they will make money. There is a row brewing because the British taxpayer could pick up the couple's estimated £3 million security bill because an American private firm would be woefully ill-equipped to protect the high-profile couple. Harry and Meghan want to use their Sussex brand to make huge amounts of money for the charities and good causes they support in the UK and around the world, but is inevitable they will become richer themselves. Meghan and Harry ruthlessly exploiting titles to rake in more money. Ruthless